Hello, let's talk about the barbituric acid assay, T-BARS assay. T-BARS detects malone dialdehyde levels, oxidative stress, and lipid peroxidation. Principle. Huh. Listen properly. The method uses the reaction of malone dialdehyde and TBA. TBA and MDA together, they form a red product called chromogen. Free radicals damage the membrane through lipid peroxidation. And in this process, a lot of byproducts form, including MDA. TBAS takes advantage of this. Detection Detection can be colorimetrically or fluorometrically using specific wavelengths. The method is precise, sensitive, and highly reproducible. Precision of extraction and analytical procedure is very high. Dissemination of T-bars in food matrices for quality control of food industries. Hey y'all, come look at this! Prepare the stocks and solutions according to the PREG manual. Calibrate the scale and then following by adjusting it to the appropriate unit uh, depending on what you are weighing. At that particular time whatever is of interest and then start weighing all your your products just follow the protocol step by step everything uh, precisely when you're done preparing you should have all your stocks and solutions in this format almost now T bars prepare the tubes accordingly Add everything according to the protocol. Place tubes in the water pot for 15 minutes and wait. 15 minutes later, kaboom! Remove and allow all tubes to cool to room temperature. Add butanol and vortex all tubes for 30 seconds each. Follow the protocol. In triplicate, transfer 100 microliters of each sample into a well of a 96 well microliter plate. Measure the absorbance using the spectrophotometer. 